Hi, today we're going to be talking about the Hedgehog Theorem, the hypotenuse leg theorem. So the Hedgehog Theorem again is the hypotenuse leg theorem, and it's used for congruence, okay? So basically it states that two right triangles are congruent if their hypotenuses and the leg are congruent. And this um, is also an if and only if statement, okay? Well, it could be an if and only if statement. Um, so let's look at this example. So we have 3, 3, 5, 5, and by the way, these are right triangles. So we see that the hypotenuse, the hypotenuses are congruent, and that the leg, one leg, is congruent. So that means by HL, these two triangles are congruent, okay? Now let's look at this triangle. Well, we see that the hypotenuses are congruent, And we don't see that the legs are congruent. Does that mean that these triangles are not congruent? Not necessarily. So we have to use the Pythagorean theorem and find. So this would be 5 squared minus 3 squared. And this would be 5 squared minus 2 squared. 5 squared minus 3 squared is 25 minus 6, uh, not 16, minus 9, which is equal to 16. So the square root of 16 is 4. 5 squared minus 2 squared is 25 minus 4, which is equal to 21, square root of 21. And square root of 21 is not equal to 4. So therefore, this triangle is not congruent. Okay, so I hope that helped, and I hope to see you soon.